We dream of Mars, a new world, waiting for us to begin again. But could humans really live there forever? Could Mars ever become a second Earth? Mars is smaller than Earth, with only 38% of our gravity. Its air is 100 times thinner, made mostly of carbon dioxide. No oxygen to breathe. No magnetic field to shield us from cosmic radiation. And temperatures cold enough to freeze carbon dioxide itself. It's beautiful, but deadly. To survive, we'd have to live beneath domes or underground bases protected from radiation and dust storms that can last for months. Water would come from ice, air from chemical machines, and food grown inside glowing greenhouses. A fragile ecosystem powered by the will to keep humanity alive. But forever? That's the question. Without gravity, our muscles would weaken, our bones would shrink, Children born on Mars might never be able to walk on Earth again. Over centuries, humans could evolve becoming a new kind of species, built for a red sky instead of a blue one. So yes, we might live on Mars, but not as Earthlings. Not as we are, to live there forever. We would have to become something new. A species reborn under the light of a distant Sunday.